Okay, so we need to look at finding the equation of a tangent line at 4 sine x at x equals 9 and also at 8 times tangent x at x equals 6. 4 sine x, we are going to go have to use uh, a y minus y1 equals m times x minus x1. Our x1 is a 9. Our y1 will be 4 times sine of 9. We'll go ahead and say that equals y1. And we plug that in our calculator. Mm. Just give us 1.64847. Now to find the m, since we've already got y1, we have to take the derivative of this. And the derivative of sine is just cosine. So it's going to be 4 times cosine be the derivative. And we plug in 9. And this is going to give us our m, our m tan, as you can say. So 4 times... Um, Oh my gosh. 4 times the cosine of 9 is this a negative 3.644. Okay. So we have all this. So we go ahead and plug it into our thing up here. Y minus Y1, which is 1.64847. Equals m, which is negative 3.64452. x minus 9. Or x1. Okay, now we just multiply these two right here out. So y minus 1.64847 equals negative 3.6445. To just times a x, which is that. Now we multiply both of these, it's going to give us a positive number. Um, let's see. That multiplied by negative 9, it's going to give us plus 32.807. Okay. Now we want to get this right here over on this side. So we had 1.64, yada, yada, and we had 1.64, all that. So y equals negative 3.64452x. We add both of these numbers. So we'll have 32.807 plus uh, 1.64847. So this is going to be plus 34.4492. And that is all for that one. And now we have this one. Okay. Well, tangent, well, we said to use the same thing, y minus y1 equals m times x minus x1. Now we have to find the derivative of this, which is the derivative of well, sorry, tangent equals sine over cosine. To find the derivative, we do cosine x times the derivative of sine x, which is cosine x, minus sine x times the derivative of cosine x, which is a negative sine x. X. This is all over that bottom one squared. So, let's clean this up a little bit. It's going to be cosine squared x. Both of these right here are going to make plus, and sine x times sine x is sine squared x over cosine squared x. 
And cosine squared x plus sine squared x just equals 1 over cosine squared x. That's our derivative. Okay. So to find our m tan, we have to do 8 times 1 over cosine squared of 6. Which will give us some very ugly number. 8 times 1 uh, divided by cosine of 6 squared. Yes, thank you. 8.67748. Okay. Uh, that's RM. So now you need to find our Y1, which is 8 times tangent of 6. Put that into the calculator. 8 times tangent of 6 this is negative 2.32805. And then we have our x is 6, x1 is 6, so we're going to go and plug all this in, y minus, well, in this case plus, since that's a negative, 2.32805. Five equals m, which is 8.67748 x minus x1. And then we're going to minus off, well, when you go and multiply, it's here out, so we'll do that. Uh, plus 2.32805 equals all this times x, which is just going to be 8.67748. 8x and this is going to be times negative 6 so it's at minus so we put that in our calculator 6 it's going to be 52.0649 I'm going to minus off all this on both sides, which gives us y equals 8.67748x minus, and we're going to do all this. So we have negative 52, all that, minus uh, 2.32. That did not work explained. Gives us 54.3929. And that is our number. Alright.